Hey guys, welcome to Trash Pick Computers, episode 9. I mean, not 9, it's been editing episode 9. Welcome to Trash Pick Computers, episode 11. 11. And, um, Bone the Dog's coming. Yeah, there you go, he's checking out all the finds. I've got a towel there, it's full of spiderwebs. I'm going to be tearing that down for parts. It has a hot swap, two hot swap bays, which is pretty cool. Another Cool Master Elite case with this strange card reader and two SATA optical drives. Probably also for parts, maybe, I don't know. Might keep it, have two matching towers, that would be nice. Um, Compag laptop, that's, yeah, been all torn down and stuff. Um, also, it's just been Christmas a couple of days ago, so best time to trash pick. The next couple of weeks are going to be really big for computer stuff because people are getting new computers, TVs, monitors, all that sort of stuff. So we're just throwing out their old gear. Telstra router, pick that up with the power supply. It's pretty nice. I'm going to set up a home network like with all kinds of fancy stuff. What the? Have you guys heard that? I'll just replay it. All kinds of fancy stuff. Not sure what that was. Oh well, also got a heat sink out of the Lenovo Pink Center M57. Of course it was there. Of course it was there. Anyway, I'm behind the camera, so. Uh, yeah, let's look at something. Bye! What I'll do is test the Telstra router. I taped over all the information because I might use this as a guest access point in the big home network I want to set up with like a big server camera and everything. I um, haven't really talked about that much on the channel, but yeah. Power goes in just here. Power button. Hmm. Power button. Okay, sadly, I think this is broken. Well, that is annoying. Power button again. Hmm. Oh, look. It is working. See the eco lights on. Cool. Oh yeah, so it does work. Cool. That's nice. Let's take a look at the compact laptop now. And I'm just going to do some one take. No fancy cuts or anything. Um, compact laptop. Just um, so screen there. Power button, keyboard, strange sticker. Punch on Australia. Um, what the hell? Um, I don't know. This is a compact laptop. Look, you can see my dog there. <laughs> wow, that is just a reflection in the laptop's lid. No hard drive. BIOS battery. Yay, they included that. No RAM. One of them's broken. And we have a wireless card. No battery. My brother is leaving the house and if he says anything I am going to point it out oh gosh oh god I just fell over that was embarrassing um optical drive USB ports phone port locking port power port VGA Ethernet HDMI USB card reader very 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 basic Let's move on to the towels now. We have the PC. It's got four gigabytes of RAM. And the Apple on two. As like it says on the front. PCI slots. Wireless card. Some digital audio thingy. Oh yeah. Um hot swap bay, other hot swap bay, hard drive. A Zeus ID cable. Probably Jax is gonna keep that cable, it's quite a nice one. Um broken power supply. Show you what I mean about it. It's a nice power supply. I would like to use it. It's Chinese. Chinese quality. But, yes, it's like bent. Yeah. It's pretty damaged because the entire top of the case is just crossed. Yeah. Like, look at that. See, so, yeah, I don't exactly think I can use this power supply. Also, if you look in here, the circuitry is all on the top, so it might be being shorted out or something. I don't know. Sorry about that. Probably looks like a bit of an idiot, but anyway. I'm an idiot. Um. Yeah. 
Okay, here's a power button. Now I might plug it in. Now I won't plug it in. I'll just tear this down for parts. Back when I pull all the parts out that I want. I said I'll just strip the entire case down. But yeah, I'll be back in a second. All the parts ready to be scrapped, minus the um, magnetic parts tray. It's just the metal on the front panel. <coughs> That's kind of right. Um, two and a half inch hot swap bay. Three and a half inch 60 gigabyte hard drive. Three and a half inch starter hot swap. Already got one of them. Cool to have two of them. Put that in the NAS, I think. Power switch and USB ports, motherboard, um, air tube, duct thingy, other thingy with thingies on it, wireless card, um, IO shield, IDE cable, that's a dead spider, don't worry. Um, ooh, this is a 6 gigabit per second SATA cable. That's a noise cable. It's not focusing. Um, power supply, it is a bit damaged. Yeah, I don't know. Also, the power input is full of a spider nest. Oh no. Great, this is a spider nest. Now I'm going to go put all this away and then... Um, yeah, it's dog approved. No. Then, yeah, I'll be back, so. Yeah. And you just heard my dad say, stay to the dog. We're back with this one. This is not green screened or edited. This is, like, yeah, it just looks really, really cool. Um, yeah, maybe you can see, I don't know. I mean, it's because this is so dark and it's kind of light out the sides. I don't know, that's probably why. I don't exactly know, I don't exactly care. Oh no, the locking point is bent, which means I can't pull off the side panel. Ugh. Right, that's going to be fun. Hopefully you can see what the hell I'm doing. Ugh. There we go. And, ta-da, we are inside. One of the drive bays is broken. Now you can see outside for some reason. Okay. One side clippy bits is broken. I can fix that. Um, a drive bay cover is sitting inside here. Good. Lots of dust in the heatsink. Yuck. Is this another board? No RAM. Um, cooler power, switching power supply, 550 watt power supply. Yay. Um, what other good stuffs in here? Spaghetti! Lots and lots of spaghetti. Um, what the? Oh, a very long zip tie. A very thick cable. Gosh, I can't make sense out of this computer. It baffles me. Decent power supply. I'll probably keep this one as is. Just put it away like this. Clean it up another day. Who really cares? Yeah, that's just the look inside this one. Uh, let's just see if I'm working what's the CPUs in this. Um, Corti Duo, Corti Quad, I reckon. Cell J775, so... Yeah. I'm also see the connectors on this power supply. Looks like there is on this power supply. Uh, yeah, I think there is three SATA connectors directly on the power supply. That's pretty good. They pulled the RAM and the hard drive out. That is annoying. I would have liked to have got the hard drive and the RAM, but anyway. Yeah, you can't win on every trash pick day, but yeah. I'll probably keep up this as is and yeah, just leave it. So, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.